Thomas Barner over to Amasia Wilkinson. And Wilkinson, Amasia Wilkinson, hey, Jordan Brock pushing the issue, finds Keisha Brady up the floor and the score. Quick timeout taken by the gut. Now putting it on the floor. Taylor Lamb and Taylor Lamb. The adjustments have you seen both teams make early on from that first quarter as Jordan Brock put her length, being able to uh, to distract the offense. As we see Owens finally get in the sports column. He's doing a great job of containing dribble penetration. Nice move from Owens on of the court. And now she picks up the steal, bounce pass up ahead to Owens, and Owens brings the team. Needs to make in the second half. I think the first thing I would have said at halftime was Brady go to the rim and score. That was the best defense that she's probably faced at this point in the game. Brock knocking it down once again. Mackenzie Coleman for three. Big check. Yes, sir. Kicks it over to Brady. Brady for three. Evens up this ball game at 31 all. Traffic <laughs> issues in Cookville at Tim. I'm sleeping on it. And I'm sleeping on Mackenzie Coleman. I'm going to tell you not to sleep. Good ball movement. Harris launches it up for three. And it goes down the first. Coach loves how she's relentless on the boards. And Keisha, Akia Harris, saying she did she so much. the state of Tennessee overall in terms of basketball as well? Oh, yeah, the long pass. The understated here is with Austin P's difficulties in finishing, they haven't been able to set up their press. All a part of that Panther pride. Will they count that one? Who had the rebound put back. That was her first two points of this second half. Brock on the other end, the 